what is up what's going on everybody and welcome back to the channel i got ty with me today what up Ty? how's it going guys i got papa boy he's out there he's uh he's doing his duties yes we got bags so if he does poop or whatever we clean that up but uh today guys we're at a lake that has gave me so much crap i'm not even playing guys like i had to fish this lake probably three times before the footage like I could actually edit it the first two times, there were errors, there were problems, just issues, it was crazy, it didn't make sense. And then the third time, me and Rello came here and we made it happen, dude. Like it was it was an awesome day. I told Ty what lurks in here, there's big bass, there's big pike. I mean, there's just big fish in here. This place gets deep. Um, I'm gonna be throwing the spinnerbait. You guys already know that. I got that and I got the jig, the chatterbait. Um, Ty actually just bought him a bait caster, guys. He went down to Wally World. He picked up one. He's gonna start learning on this so he can get used to the whole, you know, fishing and casting and how it functions. And then once he gets into it, guys, you already know. He'll hook it up. He'll get in there. But we're gonna get out here, guys. We're gonna get the boat set in and we wanna get to fishing, guys. So let's get it. Oh, look at this lake, guys. This is beautiful. Yeah, one of my favorite lakes, guys. I want to take Ty to it. Yeah. Kind of bummed me out that we went to our home lake, his family, my family's home lake, and got skunked. I he got skunked. So I brought we're it to We're going to change that today, folks. Yeah, you might want to pull this bad boy out. Yeah, here, we're going to get this all. Let's get this thing situated over here. But put our chicken, off. put our chicken over here. Yeah, guys, we, I had him stop at uh, Old Meyer. Good old Meyer, guys, little history. Picked us up a chicken, cause honestly, guys, we're gonna fish the heck out of this today. Fish all dark, like so I'm gonna start out with the jig, cause uh, that's what they were wanting last time. So we're gonna just kind of get to that. Ty's gonna get rigged up, and once he does, guys, gonna I'm it. gonna show Ty. And I'm gonna show you guys how to adjust the tension on your bait caster. So. Yeah. Let me show you how to do it. All right, guys. I'm gonna show you guys and tie real quick how to set your tension. Cause this is important if you guys don't want to backlash. All right, guys, so this is your drag, so. Okay. That's probably good. But what you do is you reel it in and watch the lure of how fast it falls. Like, you, that'll probably be a backlash. So what you do, you take this knob, take it a little bit, not a hell of a lot. See how it's lower? And usually I'm like, ah, oh, well maybe I should probably go a little bit more just in case. Now it's kind of having a resistance, drag. you can see, so. But I still stopped it with my thumb, but. Oh yeah, Not bad. For a little starter. Can I catch some of fish in there? Almost looked like I did. Yeah, okay. say, look like you told me. But heck yeah, guys, it's just all in that tension knob and then the brakes on this side. Yeah, what's, 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 what's that? What's it on right now? One. Probably, probably just leave it on one. Or you can turn it on zero if you want, because you're only doing all this stuff with the tension. So what's that? What's this over here? Oh. That's the braking on the spool to slow it down. So oh, okay. But I like to use the tension knob. Heck 
Heck yeah, guys. First one of the day. Not the biggest guy, but the skunks out of the belt. Heck yeah. Boom, boom. There you go. Big bass. Dude. Nice. That's my boy, dude. Woo! That's a beautiful fish. A little two pounder, maybe. Alright guys, we're getting back. And that was on the old spinner bait. There he goes, Papa. Heck yeah. Ugh. Fish on. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You got a yeah, I do. Yeah, Papa. I got him. Oh shit. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, Papa. First pike in the summer without uh, not ice fishing. Oh, it's a little bad. There you are. Hang on to the thing, dude. Yeah, no, I didn't. I don't want to lose my clips. That would have been. We'd be slamming it up. <laughs> you wanted to bite me. That was awesome. But these are nice so when you do Yeah, them. I know. That was sweet. I'm about to grab some. Dude. Woo! It just, my freaking pull, it like stuck. And then like, I went to reel it again and I was like, oh, that's moving. Dude, smashed it. The sun, sunfish color. A little, oh, dude, he, dude. Crushed it, look at it. Bent the shit out of it. Oh yeah, woo! That is awesome, broke the ice. We got the skunk out of the last two fishing. I was about to see, dude, like all the winds are going over here. How is it going to be? Oh. 
Came yeah. over the in the middle island like you're talking about. Heck yeah, guys. Thank you. Yeah, I just thought it. Ooh, live action. Adios. 